Cindy Stover, and I am the Justice Mobilizer here with the CRC in Canada. Um, just sharing a quick video update as we slowly begin to leave our sunny summer season and we move into pumpkin themed sweater weather time. Um, there's also another season that we're focusing on here at the CRC's Center for Public Dialogue, and that is election season. Everyone's favorite, right? Wink. <laughs> Um, one thing that's very top of mind for me in this election is climate change. All of the political leaders are talking about it, many of them have very different opinions on it, and many people outside of the political realm are also concerned about our changing climate. From indigenous peoples to environmental activists, from farmers to youth to people who are all of those things, everyone is beginning to see how our world is being drastically um, changed and altered by our carbon emissions and by higher global temperatures. And all of this matters to me, and I think matters to us as supporters of the Center for Public Dialogue, not just because we want to combat climate change, but also because it's our calling as Christians to be stewards of this big and beautiful creation that God has gifted us with. So with that in mind, my question to you is, how is climate change and creation care impacting how you're gonna vote in the upcoming election? I'm not gonna tell you who to vote for, that's not what we do. The Center for Public Dialogue is a nonpartisan agency. Um, but what I'm personally planning to do, what I can tell you about, um, is looking into what each political party in Canada is saying about how they're going to combat climate change and help our country transition into using renewable resources in the future. Now you can do that too. Uh, you can click on the link above and use the handy tool from Shake Up the Establishment to compare the climate solutions being, forward, uh, being put forward by Canada's major political parties. So check that out. Um, leave some comments below about what you think about that. And thanks for listening. Hopefully uh, we can chat and share soon.